Sounds great. Thanks for staying with us. The sorority known for its crimson and cream colors marked a significant milestone in its history today as January 13, 2013 marked the 100th year since Delta Sigma Theta Sorority Incorporated was founded. To commemorate the special day in the sorority's history, local Delta chapters held a number of events today, starting with the church service at St. Agnes Anglican Church. But the celebrations will not end today, says president of the sorority's New Providence chapter, Janice Bullard. Uh, we've been in the Bahamas since 1979 with the incorporation of the Nassau Bahamas Alumni Chapter. Um, and I have quite a few of my sorors here today from both the Nassau Bahamas Alumni Chapter as well as the Upsilon Zeta Chapter of the College of the Bahamas. We have so many activities planned, but of course, um, at the core of it all is scholarship, sisterhood, and service. So one of the big things that we have planned for this year is to continue with our community service efforts. So we will be assisting um, as well, continue our assistance, of, of course, in the community. Um, as I mentioned, Marathon Bahamas, we will continue to do what we would call, for example, senior sizzles. We would continue to assist with the children's homes, and the list goes on and on. There's so many things, exciting things that we have planned. She adds that the week of community service will end with volunteer service at Marathon Bahamas, but there are some major events the sorority has planned later this year. The sorority's vice president explains one of its biggest planned projects. It's actually a home that we intend to bring in women that have lost their homes because of fire or hurricane so that they can transit into their own spaces. We want to make something available, so we're, we're garnering as much sponsorship as we can so that we can build this home. Another major event for the Deltas this year is re-establishing its College of the Bahamas chapter after years of absence. But this year will be our official year back on the campus because we really didn't have a chapter running active since 2008, so we will start intake. Founded in 1913 at Howard University, the sorority now has more than 350,000 members in eight countries. Well, that's it for this portion of NB12 Weekend. Here's a look at tonight's Doctors Hospital Health Tip.